वेलकम बैक एवरी वन टू अनदर ट्यूटोरियल ऑन टैबलू दिस सीरीज ऑफ वीडियोज विल हेल्प यू टेक योर स्किल्स फ्रॉम बिगनर टू एक्सपर्ट लेवल इन टैबलू डो नॉट फोगेट टू हिट दी रेड सब्सक्राइब बटन एंड दी बेल आइकन सो दैट यू आर दी फर्स्ट वन टू नो वेन एवर आई अपलोड एनी न्यू वीडियो इन टूडे सेशन वी विल सी हाउ टू डिसेबल हाईलाइटिंग इन टैबलू Let me first show you the demo of what we will be doing today. Here I have a dashboard that shows sales of different subcategories. Here this chart shows the profit earned in case of different segments and at the top I have added this apply button that will allow user to apply all the filters at once. and the reset button will allow user to reset all the filters if you want to know how to create these apply and reset filter buttons then you will find the link of these videos in the description below now let me select few filters deselect furniture from state let me deselect alabama florida and from sub category let me deselect appliances art and binders sub category now click on apply both the charts have updated based on the filters applied you will observe that here we can see highlighting on the apply button the requirement is that we need to remove this highlighting from this apply button to have a clean looking dashboard also you might have noticed that when we click on any bar then the selected bar gets highlighted and the remaining bars gets grayed out so we also need to remove this type of highlighting from the charts let me go to another dashboard select few filters here t select furniture now from the state let me deselect alabama and florida now when i will click on this apply button you will notice that we don't see any highlighting on the apply button and also when i click on any bar it's not getting highlighted let's jump to tableau and see how to disable highlighting from the charts and this apply button first go to this apply worksheet so we will create two new calculated fields click on the drop down click on create calculated field let's name it true and here write down true click on okay then create a second calculated field click on the drop down click on create calculated field let's name it false and here we will write down false click on okay now drag both the calculated fields that we have created to detail in this apply worksheet first drag false then the true calculated field also to detail now go to the dashboard and we will add a filter action go to dashboard click on actions now we will add filter action click on this add action drop down and select filter let's name it remove apply highlight here the source worksheet will be the apply worksheet deselect all the remaining worksheets run action on select the target sheet will be the apply worksheet and not the dashboard and here select show all values here we will add a filter click on selected fields the source field will be the true calculated field that we have created and the target field will be false calculated field that we have created click on okay click on okay again now let's select few filters 
from this deselect furniture next from the state filter let's deselect florida and alabama from sub category let's deselect appliances art binders so now when we will click on this apply filter the charts have updated and all the filters that we selected are applied and also you will notice that now we are not getting the highlight when we clicked on apply button so using this filter action we can remove the highlight from the apply button that we have created here we can also remove the highlights from the bar chart you might have observed that when we click on any bar then the selected bar gets highlighted and the remaining bars gets grayed out now to remove this highlighting also we will have to add another filter action let's go to this worksheet and create a duplicate of the true false calculated field that we have created click on the drop down click on duplicate let's also create a duplicate of this true calculated field click on the drop down and click on duplicate now drag these duplicate calculated field to detail go to the dashboard and we will add a filter action click on dashboard click on actions click on this add action drop down and select filter the source worksheet will be this sub category sales worksheet so deselect the remaining worksheets run action on select and the target sheet will be the new sub category sales worksheet and not the dashboard clearing the selection will show all values now add a filter click on selected fields here click on the drop down and source field will be the true copy field that we have created and the target field will be false copy click on okay click on okay again now you will observe that when we click on any bar it's not getting highlighted so in this way we can remove highlighting in tableau by adding a filter action so this was all that i had to cover in this session i have added the link of this workbook in the description below thanks for watching this session i hope this session was helpful see you in the next tutorial